the development of civilization was sort of signposted by the discovery of materials. And Cran is about discovering new materials. Nanoscience is really, I guess, uh, a branch of material science. So anything that is made of something, you know, has a relevance towards nanoscience. So what nano means is that you're getting small. But the ability to, uh, to make materials, to uh, manipulate materials at that level, which is really working with molecules and atoms when you're at that size, it creates incredible possibilities uh, to make all sorts of new materials, which in turn make new capabilities. The most common man-made material you know is plastic. And plastic is, is used today simply because it's light and it can be quite strong. Um, but actually what Cran is doing now in terms of innovating plastic technologies is to make it even stronger again. So we're now taking plastics, regular old plastics, and adding in nanoscale ingredients to increase the strength of these plastics. Over the last decade, or indeed the last 20 years, technologies have got much more complicated. And that's because people have managed to make uh, the microchips smaller and smaller and smaller down to the nanoscale. It's revolutionized how the ICT industry works and operates today. If you look at Ireland at the moment, there's about 250,000 jobs linked to companies that will be utilizing nanotechnology within their businesses. And indeed, about 16 billion euro, about 10% of our global exports from Ireland are products that are nano-enabled. It's understood to be this, this new technology wave. And I think we're very fortunate here in Trinity College that we've made a large investment in nanotechnology and nanoscience. And we have some of the world's leaders in that area here in Trinity College. We create the new technology. We patent our ideas. We patent our engineered new devices. And that creates new, uh, new revenue. We've got a nice setup here in, in, in Crown in that uh, we have industry people actually seconded to Crown and they form the bridge. We talk with Crown, we, we look at what work they're going to do, we connect that then with our researchers in the States who are the guys inventing the next transistors. And that's quite a unique model actually that we have going in Ireland. It's unique to Intel actually. Intel doesn't do this anywhere else in the world where we've got the, that sort of connectivity going on. We believe here in Cran and in other uh, nanoscience centres around the world that in fact in the near future this sort of technology will be everywhere and so one example is putting nanomaterials into beer bottles to keep the fizz in for longer. I mean a plastic bottle is about as crude as you can get but in five to ten years these things will be enabled by nanotechnology. It will be everywhere. So what we're trying to get people to understand is that if they can connect with that kind of sense of uh, what we do as being important for them, it becomes more real and more relevant. Contributing to society is very important. People, ideas, innovation, and then linking all that with companies to transform agendas here in Ireland.